Hi guys, it's Sandy here. If you're new here, I am a South African beauty and lifestyle YouTuber and I try to post new videos every week. I'm finally back with another cooking type of video. I know it's been a while and I'm going to be making Korean fried chicken wings. Hey, if you know me, you know I don't like cooking proper things. By that I mean anything that's not noodles. I've never made chicken wings before. I know that sounds weird. This box is created by a, a TikTok creator that I follow. So she's a chef I believe her name is Talia and I saw she was advertising these boxes where she pre makes the sauce and spice mix and stuff that you need to make crispy Korean chicken wings and I was like that's so cool um, and this box is 250 Rand and then shipping was 99 Rand but I think you can collect from Korea Mart if you are in the Cape Town area. I'll go into a close-up and show you everything that's in this box. The cooking ingredients and extra snacks. And I thought it was really worth the price. I mean, I would love cooking new things if I'm given the things that I need to cook with, you know. Because I'm really lazy to go and like mix all the spices and stuff. And sometimes I don't have a lot of the spices and things. Let's get into it. I'm gonna show you what's in the box and then I'm going to go straight on to showing you how I'm cooking it and towards the end of the video I'll show you the result and do a little taste test. This is the inside of the box. We have a little business card and um, there's some sweet honey butter popcorn snack. And then the instructions on how to make the chicken wings and some tips um, to get them nice and crispy. There's crunchy pepero, a seaweed roll, um, choco pie, a peach fizzy drink, some haichu sweeties, two packets of seaweed snack, and then this is the stuff for actually making the chicken um, and spice topping you put over the wings, um, spice mix that you mix into the flour. I used half a kg or eight um, chicken wings. This is the ones from Woolies. And I cut off the tip of the wing because like, Aish, who eats that? And then as suggested in the instructions, I cut the chicken bone at the center so that the wings are more bite size. Um, I've never done that before but I thought like this is really cool and I used the Lance wood double thick plain yogurt. Now since I'm using half the recommended amount of chicken because all the stuff in the box is made for one kg or 16 wings now i halved everything so i used three teas three tablespoons of yogurt and like half a tablespoon of lemon juice i didn't have fresh lemons on hand unfortunately just gave that a good old rub give your meat a good old rub i cling wrapped it and put it in the fridge Minimum one hour and then maximum overnight, but I was kind of lazy to cook the wings and I forgot about it in the fridge, so I left it for like four hours. Anyway, then I took the flour mix again. I used half and I used half the spice mix and um, mixed that together to make the coating. So here's my chicken wings that I took out of the fridge. They look the same like when I put it in the fridge, I guess. Um, yeah, I don't know why I'm showing you. Like, it literally looks the same. Anyways, yeah, I'm coating the thing. I have made sudden fried chicken before, so I have a little bit of coating experience, I guess. <laughs> anyway, it looks like this now. Uh, anyway, okay, yeah, yeah, it is now. Now I'm letting them chill, right, for like... 10 15 minutes before I actually go and fry them just to let the corn starch I don't know do its thing that's what it said on the instructions uh, so I heated the oil to medium heat while it was eating I was like yo this is the perfect time to eat a snack because I was hungry at this point yo but I love choco pies so I'm just chowing one of that and here we go I'm frying the chicken I don't know what medium heat is, 
but I'm assuming this was medium heat. I don't know, it could be hot heat heat because the oil is bubbling. Like I, I really don't know. I fried the chicken wings. I'm frying, look at I'm frying them. I'm flipping them. I fried them for eight minutes each. That's what the instructions said, and that's what I did. Taking them out after like eight, nine minutes, letting the oil soak into the paper towel. Frying my second batch. Now this was after all the pieces of chicken wings was done being fried. They're just cooling and draining. Now making the sauce. I wanted to use 50 grams of butter. I don't know how much that is. I'm assuming this is 50 grams. But then I was thinking this is too much to be 50 grams. Anyway, it was too late. I used crushed ginger and garlic because I didn't have fresh garlic cloves. And I used half of the sauce base in there, heat it in this pot, give it a stir. It smells really nice. And uh, once that sauce kind of cooled a bit, but like I don't think I let it cool enough. And I think this caused a problem. Anyways, this was really fun coating the chicken wings with the, the sauce. It's probably the, the f most fun part. Um, and I sprinkled the spice on. And this was the final product. It smelled so good. And yeah, we have the wings. So I only made half a kg. I think the recipe calls for one kg, but it's uh, a lot of wings. I used half the things in the box. Let's taste this out. I'm surprised I didn't mess up too much. Also, I have the peach drink that was in the box. Mmm. Mmm, mm, it's really nice. I'm gonna do a taste test of this one. Looks good, smells good. Let's hope it tastes good. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that's nice. Do you hear the crunch? It's not like as crunchy as it should be though. It should be crunchier, but I, I did something wrong. It was not as crunchy as it should be, but um, it's still delicious chicken wings. Also, I'm not usually like a chicken wing fan, but this is nice. I can't believe I made it. I really can't wait to see what other boxes she has in the future. Because I would totally buy them all. This is so nice for people like me who don't like cooking because then you can make something cool and you kind of have help because you have the recipe and you have like all the things made for you already. It did take me quite a while. Mm. Yeah, but the Woolies chicken is good. Mm. Mm -hmm. finger licking good <laughs> mm. let me try a different piece mm. is there something wrong to not make it crunchy oh luckily I still have the second half that I can experiment with. Mm. Mm. But the, the coating mix and the sauce mm. it really makes it tasty. <laughs> it's not spicy. Not really, a little spicy. I'm really bad at eating wings, I'm sorry. Oh man, I'm eating this so messy. Mm. Like why don't we have South African peach flavored drinks? Peach is such a nice flavor. And don't talk to me about peach flavored iced tea. That thing tastes like armpits. Anyways, I'm gonna enjoy this.
off camera but i hope you enjoyed today's video thank you so much for watching don't forget to give this video a thumbs up comment down below subscribe to my channel don't forget to follow my socials which will be linked down below in the description and i will see you guys in the next video bye <coughs> yeah, bye